You Why know what I hope more than anything is that the first thing they look at are the nine ancestral tenants. These things that our early ancestors have done since the beginning of time. 50 years ago, we had almost 50% higher testosterone. It's really clear things are happening today in the modern world. And, and if you look at modern-day primitive culture tribes that are kicking ass, their neurochemistry is pretty good. I don't know if their hormones have been measured. Um, but, you know, the low-hanging fruit here really is sleep, eat, move, shield, connect, cold, sun, fight. And now, there's work that has to go into that. There's mm -hmm. no doubt about that. Um, my hope and goal, like, is, is people are saying, hey, so you can be an advocate for it now? And I would say, this is nuanced. You know, for a young person, hell no. You know, there's no place, there's no form of it unless you have hypogonadism instead of like, instead of, uh, or unless there's like a physiological impairment mm -hmm. um, for you to produce adequate testosterone, you, there's no place for it if you're a young person. Um, now, I think if, if you're, I don't know, in your mid 30s and you know about some of these natural levers like the nine ancestral tenants and you're doing this stuff, um, give yourself that shot. Now, if you're doing this stuff and you still have low testosterone, if you feel like shit, if you look like shit, if you function like shit, go talk to someone who knows their shit and have that conversation and decide for themselves.